Hello YouTube, it's Christonian here and we are playing Kriya. We're back on part two of our let's play here. Sorry for the sprint. As you can see, I get a little exhaustion meter. I'm just going to level this area out just a bit and this is where we're gonna place most of our stuff. And we're gonna go up and I remember seeing copper somewhere. So we're gonna look for that copper. I believe it's copper, might be iron. We'll check it in a second. So again, it's a little slow at the beginning because we just don't have any tools, advanced tools. But we also go up in our gathering speed and such as the game progresses. And we can also unlock it by going through our talents, which I could show you in this episode. Because we might already have enough points to level up. Uh, at least our gathering. You can see it on the uh, general tab there on the side. It says 26 TP for gathering uh, talent. So that's points towards leveling up. I could probably put a door right here, which would work perfect. And then anything that crawls up from the mist below shall not affect us. So craft. Research desk. Oh, we still need a feather. Hmm. Uh, what else do I want to do? I'm going to look at our inventory here. So yeah, we did get copper ore. Leather! Wow! I never got that at all. Last game. I got... Uh, ooh! Arrow. Uh, I got uh, cloth. That's what I thought it was when it dropped. So as you can see, our inventory is already filling up pretty fast. Yeah, the name of the game right now is to get our uh, is to get our feather ready. Okay, so I'm gonna switch back over, plumb this out a bit. So again, I can go six, and then now I can go inventory and put dirt into my right hand, and then actually build myself a little bit of a staircase here. Ooh, jackpot. Uh, let's actually, ah. Oh, let's go like that, there we go. Okay. And that looks like a huge copper vein. Which is awesome. But I was also uh, getting jacked up with all this uh, loot here. So I just want to check what that was. Just stone. Looks like we got glass or something. Ooh. Marshmallow seed. Plant the marshmallow tree. <laughs> Children eagerly wait the blossoming marshmallow tree in the spring. I'm gonna mine all this copper. And then we're probably, I'll, maybe I'll just mine a bit of this copper so I don't bore the crap out of you guys. And we'll go to, uh, we'll go out and get a feather. Maybe I found it last time just by luck, just by going through like pots or, uh, just like I did on this one. Okay. So if I press 6, here we go. Lights up the area. Still haven't found any other ore. This is the only ore I found in game so far. So if I go 1, I'm going to go like that. Okay. Back to 6. Which is actually quite useful. Then I don't have to place my uh, torch down anywhere. And that's a big drop that I'll never survive, so... You also get fall damage, just like any other game. Okay, let's go this way. So that's a dead end. Oop. Oop. Jump! There we go. Okay, let's see how my wood is. 
Yes, I said, let's see my ward. That's 16 there. Yep, that is copper there. And we got some treasure here. Haha, -ha, two more torches. Awesome. Uh, not three. I'm going to go to six. Yep. And I'm going to jump up and around. Ah, let's go this way. We'll go left for now. In the daytime, those guys are usually neutral. I don't know why they're... That kind of looks different down there. I don't know if that's rock or if it's actually something different. Uh, let's go three. You can also just hold it. Okay, six again. I just want to make sure I don't lose anything. So there's another crystal and we can actually, if you uh, right click and interact, uh, you can uh, teleport from crystal to crystal. It's like fast travel, which is awesome. Ouch. So let's gather this while we're here because this will give us a uh, something we can research because it's not in our normal biome. I intend to go back to our house. We're just searching for now. Those guys are bastards. They're like always, I found, um, aggroed. Like they're ready for combat kind of thing. Cactuses seem to not hurt me yet, so again, this is alpha. See, that's their attack. Is It's a distance attack. So here's another one. So uh, maybe if we have, there we go. So quick travel, uh, sunbeam crystal, 388. Oh, we didn't click on the one that was close to ours. So that's why that sunbeam one comes. But it gives you an idea. It only costs one crystal. And then the oil crystal, you can attune it for uh, another three crystals. We'll see. We might actually have enough. Uh, inventory. Yeah, we have five crystals. But I think attune makes it my head place. Yeah, see, you gotta watch out. Some stuff just aggro's right away. And also, you gotta make sure that you're not going over a jump that uh, you can't come back from, you know? Like, that might have sucked. But I think I can, uh, I can build a dirt... Oh, that sucks. Uh, two... Oh, no. <laughs> Crap. Uh, where was it? That I oh six. Oh yes. <laughs> if you're not paying attention, you can die easily that way. Let's actually uh, try this guy. So three. Remember, these guys are really hard. There we go, feather, yes! Should we risk it and try killing another? We'll see. I've seen these guys draw cloth before. There we go. So let's go like that. And sometimes these monsters aggro forever, which is one thing I don't like. They'll chase me across the map, kind of thing. Uh, yes, we'll gain health back just by progressing through the game. I like how the backgrounds change with every new biome. It's a nice little touch. Hmm. Meh. Let's leave it for now. Okay. I think this might be ours. Nope. This is still, we're only at Sunbeam. I was actually surprised at the distance between the first two. 
it's usually a bigger distance, kind of like uh, the one in the oil area. Okay, so here we go. There's home, but we're still looking for our crystal. Ah, got stuck in there. Gotta go around. There we go. What the heck is that? Hmm. This might be a uh, enemy base. But I've never seen it like this before, so I don't know what it is. Got some cloth. Some more iron there. Did I go past our initial crystal? That's weird. I don't remember that. That's a dead zone. A dead biome. Hmm. We started where the big trees were, weren't wasn't it? Yeah, it was kind of right there, wasn't it? Weird. Maybe that was our first one. Anyways, this is where we're going to set up base, and we'll uh, make a catalyst. That's the only thing I've researched from a, a crystal, which is make your own home base kind of thing, I think. So, crafting. Uh, bo bo boom, research desk, craft one, because that's all we need. Then you go inventory, and you place it like so. Then once you want to do some research, you right click, you go inventory again, pick up the item that you want to put inside. Let's say stone instead of feather, and then we can research certain weapons. So if we go research, it says stone arrow recipe, but you only got a part of that research. So this is Christonian here playing Kriya. Hope you guys enjoyed it so far and see you guys next time. Bye. And as always, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share guys. See you guys next time. Bye.